What's up everybody? Well, I got another gameplay video for you guys today, and today we're gonna finish up the Halo Infinite campaign videos up on the main computer here. So hopefully it will be trouble free just like it was on the secondary computer, but only time will tell. The laptop was having a little bit of some crashing problems. Every once like five to seven minutes, it would just have a crash. It would just crash right to desktop. But I did put some new drivers on there. They've got December drivers now on the Alienware website. So I figured I'd try them out. So I'm hoping that it's just that game acting up and it's not just gonna do that in every game I try to play now. Otherwise that's not good. It's like, hey, I wanna take my $3,000 laptop and play a game for six minutes. Oh, okay, I'm done. <laughs> Well, whatever. Hopefully it'll just to be doing that in that game and that's it. But that's besides the point. Let's not waste any more time and let's go hop into this game as soon as it's done downloading anyway. All right. Now let's see what settings we're going to run for the main computer here. We want to do that 95. I completely almost forgot about that. But other than that, we're going to go all the way up to ultra settings, just like we did on the secondary computer. If that one handled it well, this one should be able to handle it no problem too. Keyboard is should. Hopefully it doesn't crash or do anything goofy. But anyway, that's the bottom. So why don't we go hop into the game? And we'll find out. Well now, here we are in the game. So let's run around and we'll see how it plays. So far seems to be all right. But we just started, so it could start stuttering like mad any second now. So let's run around and go see. Or crash or anything, who knows. Ah, so that's how you do that. I thought there was some grappling system in this game. Huh. Well, I wonder. Can I attach myself to him? Yes. And then you can just, like, light their face up, like, point blank. So that's a pretty effective way of killing. I thought I saw one hiding in those weeds. Hey, stop pummeling me with the damn machine gun. Uh-oh. How about to die? Let's back off for a second here. All right. We can flip the warthog. Alright, you guys want to get in this thing or what? Going for a ride. Ready to do some damage. Enemy vehicles in Another ghost coming our way. That was a very short-lived drive. Wow. That that did not work well. you eventually see I told you I'd get you eventually aha there's still a few more Who else be shooting?
Oh, well, he didn't last very long, did he? Got him. Okay, and it uh, decided to crash on this computer too. Well, all right then. I guess on the camera and we'll see what it does there. Well, all right, we had a uh, crash, so I guess it's not just my laptop that crashes this game randomly. I'm glad to see you. So let's see if it does it when we're not using shadow play. Not like that was the problem with the laptop. That one just crashed after about, oh, this one actually I think crashed in four minutes and 50 seconds, so it couldn't even quite make it to five or six minutes. But that's what the laptop did. Five, six, maybe seven minutes, and it was like, nope, I'm done. I'm going to the desktop now. Goodbye. So, seems like it's uh, a little unstable here, too. And everything is uh, stock, so I don't think it's, and yet, I don't think it should be anything in my computer being, like, unstable. I mean, unless something's dying. But I don't think so. I'm starting to think this game is just really, really unstable. Anyway, I think I went the wrong way. I was trying to find that bridge that I kept going down to fight those peeps. I think I have gone the wrong way. But that's okay. We'll figure our way back. Yep, there it is. But at least when it crashed, it gave me an opportunity to turn HDR on, so that's cool. I forgot what keys make you go to the right seat, so I'm just gonna get out and go back in. terrible. I should never be allowed to drive in that game. That's okay. We'll just re freaking load and try again. This time without the car. Although I should probably get something other than this from over here. As much as I like one hitting almost anything. I'm gonna grab this instead. So now I got these two, we should be good. Let's reload that one.
right, cool. We got all them. Hell yeah, well we finished them off. Well, that thing got blown up. But in any case, it might crash any second now. It might crash in 20 minutes, but we did get one crash. But in any case, I think that's enough camera recorded gameplay. So let's go wrap this video on up. Well, all right, guys, that's a wrap for Halo Infinite campaign. And we had a crash, so that wasn't cool. But beyond that, we were getting good frame rates and frame times and all that, so I'm starting to think maybe the laptop isn't the cause of it crashing. This game might just be a crashy game. Secondary computer didn't do it, but just because it didn't do it, blah. Just because it didn't do it when we were recording doesn't mean it will never do it by any means, so we'll see what happens when we do the multiplayer section next, because that is next. We're done with the campaign. We've done it on everything we can, because I'm pretty sure besides streaming, you cannot play this Game Pass stuff on a Steam Deck. 
Obviously, someone correct me if I'm wrong. But anyway, that's all I got for you guys for this particular video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, because I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you guys. And until the next video, peace out, guys.